Hello and thank you, dear viewer, for joining us on this enchanting journey into the depths of imagination. The channel is growing and I thank you for your support and presence. It makes these stories come to life and we're thrilled to have you here. Tonight, we invite you to relax, unwind, and open your heart to a tale of wonder and adventure. In a world unlike any other, where mushrooms tower like trees and fireflies create constellations, we'll follow the tiny adventurer, Andy, on a quest that will take him to the heart of the magical mushroom forest. There, he'll encounter the Great Mushroom Council, traverse the Bridge of Luminance, and even step into the realm of light and shadow. So get comfortable, let your cares drift away, and allow your imagination to wander. Our story begins now in the world of the Enchanted Mushroom Forest. In a world not unlike our own, but far smaller, there lived an ant named Andy. Andy was no ordinary ant. He was an adventurer at heart, always yearning for something more than the everyday life of the ant colony. One sunny morning, as the golden rays of the sun streamed through the mushroom canopy, Andy woke up with a feeling of restlessness. He had heard tales of a mysterious and magical mushroom world hidden deep within the forest, a place where mushrooms were as tall as trees and fireflies created constellations in the night sky. With a sense of determination, Andy decided that today would be the day he set out on his grand adventure. He crawled out of his snug tunnel in the ant hill, past his fellow ants who were busy tending to their daily chores. They waved and wished him well, though they couldn't fathom why Andy would want to leave their safe and structured world. As Andy ventured deeper into the forest, the world around him seemed to grow larger and more enchanting. Blades of grass became towering trees, and pebbles became massive boulders. But it was the mushrooms that truly captured his imagination. Their caps stretched high into the sky, and their stems were as wide as rivers. Each one was a work of art, painted with colors that didn't exist in the anthill. Andy's tiny heart raced with excitement as he stepped into the heart of the mushroom forest. He knew that his journey had only just begun and that there were countless wonders and challenges awaiting him in this magical world but he was determined to explore, to discover, and to live a life beyond the tunnels of his colony. And so, with each tiny step, Andy, the tiny adventurer, ventured deeper into the mushroom world, ready to uncover the mysteries that lay ahead and make his mark on this enchanting realm. As dawn broke over the magical mushroom world, Andy awoke with renewed excitement for his journey. He stretched his tiny legs and packed his meager belongings, eager to explore deeper into the forest. The enchanting wonders of this place beckoned him forward. Continuing on his path, Andy soon came across a meandering stream. The water was crystal clear and flowed gently over smooth pebbles. But what caught Andy's eye were the peculiar mushrooms lining the stream's edge. 
They glowed softly in shades of blue and green, casting an ethereal light on the water. Andy carefully stepped onto a large mushroom cap that served as a makeshift bridge. As he crossed the stream, he couldn't resist dipping his tiny antennae into the cool water. The sensation was invigorating, and he took a moment to savor the refreshing experience. On the other side of the stream, the forest transformed into a lush, mossy paradise. The ground was soft and carpeted with emerald moss that seemed to glow with life. Tiny flowers in brilliant shades of red and orange dotted the landscape, their sweet fragrance filling the air. But it wasn't just the beauty of the forest that enchanted Andy. It was the sense of magic that seemed to permeate every corner. He heard soft whispers carried by the breeze, and the mushrooms themselves seemed to communicate through subtle movements and shifts in color. Andy couldn't help but wonder if the legends were true, the legends of ancient treasures hidden deep within this forest. He had heard tales of mushrooms that could grant wishes and crystals with mysterious powers. Could he, a tiny ant, be destined to discover such wonders? As the day wore on, Andy continued his exploration of the enchanted mushroom forest. He encountered friendly creatures who shared stories of their own adventures and offered guidance on the forest's secrets. They spoke of the Great Mushroom Council, a gathering of wise beings who held the knowledge of the forest's deepest mysteries. With each step, Andy's determination grew. He knew that he was on a quest not just for himself, but for the entire ant colony. The secrets of the mushroom world held the potential to change their lives forever. Suddenly, a rustling in the underbrush caught his attention. Andy froze, his senses on high alert. Out from the foliage emerged a curious creature he had never seen before, a squirrel, but not like any squirrel from his world. This one had fur that shimmered like a cascade of golden leaves, and its eyes sparkled with a mischievous twinkle. The squirrel hopped closer, its bushy tail twitching with curiosity. Well, what have we here? It chattered in a melodious voice that seemed to harmonize with the forest itself. Andy mustered his courage and introduced himself. I am Andy, an adventurer from the ant colony, exploring this magical mushroom world. Who are you? The squirrel grinned and flicked its tail dramatically. I am Silva, the guardian of these woods, and I must say I've never met an ant quite like you, Andy. What brings you to our enchanting realm? Andy shared his quest to uncover the secrets of the Great Mushroom Council and the ancient treasures that were said to reside within the forest. Silva listened intently nodding at the mention of the council. The Great Mushroom Council is indeed a keeper of knowledge, Silva said, but gaining an audience with them is no easy task. They value wisdom and courage above all else. To prove your worth, you must first complete three challenges, each testing a different aspect of your character. Andy's heart raced at the thought of these challenges, but he was determined to press on. Silva, 
seeing the spark of determination in Andy's eyes, offered to be his guide through the forest and help him prepare for the trials ahead. And so, with an unexpected ally in the form of Silva, the shimmering squirrel, Andy's journey took an exciting turn. He knew that the path ahead was filled with unknown challenges and adventures, but he was ready to face them head on, armed with the wisdom of the forest and the companionship of his new friend. Under the watchful guidance of Silva, the guardian squirrel of the enchanted mushroom forest, Andy embarked on his quest to prepare for the challenges that lay ahead with newfound determination. Their first challenge was to collect the mysterious glowing spores that could only be found deep within the heart of the mushroom forest. These spores were rumored to possess magical properties and were an essential part of gaining the Great Mushroom Council's favor. As Andy and Silva journeyed deeper into the forest, the air grew thicker with enchantment. The mushrooms here were unlike any they had seen before, radiating a soft, otherworldly light. The ground beneath their feet was spongy, covered in a luminescent carpet of moss. Silva explained that the glowing spores could only be harvested during the evening under the light of the full moon. They had to be collected in a special pouch woven from the silken threads of rare firefly cocoons to preserve their magic. The anticipation of the moon's ascent filled the air with excitement. Andy and Silva prepared by crafting a pouch from the delicate threads of firefly cocoons they had gathered earlier. As the sun dipped below the mushroom canopy and the first stars began to twinkle, the forest transformed into a surreal dreamscape. As they continued their journey, the forest began to change once more. The towering mushrooms gave way to a vast, open meadow. In the distance, they could see a towering mushroom that appeared to touch the sky. Silva told Andy that this was their destination, the sacred mushroom where the Great Mushroom Council resided. With renewed determination, Andy and Silva approached the sacred mushroom ready to face the final challenge and seek an audience with the council. The anticipation and excitement were palpable as they stood at the threshold of their ultimate goal, knowing that the most significant test of all awaited them inside the mushroom's towering cap. As Andy and Silva stood before the towering sacred mushroom they marveled at its grandeur. The mushroom's cap was so massive that it seemed to reach the heavens, and its surface was adorned with intricate patterns that pulsed with a soft, ethereal light. Silva, who had guided Andy through the forest's challenges, turned to him with a reassuring smile. This is it, Andy. The final challenge awaits within. But before we proceed, there is someone you must meet. With a flick of her bushy tail, Silva beckoned a tiny luminescent creature forward. It was a sprite no larger than a firefly, with wings that shimmered like spun moonlight. The sprite's eyes sparkled with an otherworldly wisdom, and it radiated an aura of tranquility. This is Lumi, Silva introduced. Lumi is the guardian of the sacred mushroom and a cherished friend of the Great Mushroom Council. 
Lumi, this is Andy, the brave aunt who seeks an audience with the council. Lumi extended a delicate hand, and Andy, in his tiny form, shook it with a mixture of awe and gratitude. As they followed the map's guidance, they encountered riddles, puzzles, and challenges that tested their wits and understanding of the forest's mysteries. With each trial, Andy's resolve deepened, and he felt a growing connection to the forest and its wisdom. Uh, finally, after what felt like an eternity of challenges, they arrived at a magnificent chamber bathed in soft, radiant light. At the center of the chamber sat the Great Mushroom Council, a gathering of wise and ancient mushrooms, each with a presence that exuded wisdom and serenity. Andy knew that he had reached the heart of his quest. The council members regarded him with eyes that seemed to hold the secrets of the universe, and he knew that he was about to embark on a conversation that would change the course of his life and the destiny of his ant colony. In the presence of the Great Mushroom Council, Andy felt both humbled and determined. These wise and ancient beings emanated an aura of profound knowledge, and their gazes seemed to penetrate deep into his soul. The head of the council, a towering mushroom with a cap that reached the highest point in the chamber, spoke with a voice that resonated like a gentle breeze through the forest. Welcome, young adventurer. You have shown great courage, resourcefulness, and wisdom in your journey through our forest. Now tell us what brings you here seeking our audience. With conviction in his voice, Andy recounted the tale of his colony's struggles and the hope that had driven him to explore the enchanted mushroom world. He spoke of the legends of the Great Mushroom Council, the treasures hidden within the forest, and the dreams of a better life for his fellow ants. The Council listened attentively, their expressions inscrutable. When Andy finished, a hushed silence filled the chamber. Then, the head of the Council spoke again, your determination and pure intentions have brought you before us. We have watched over this forest for centuries, and we sense a destiny intertwined with your journey. With that, the council members shared their own wisdom and revealed ancient truths about the forest's magic and balance. They spoke of the importance of cooperation among all creatures, the harmony between the forest and its inhabitants, and the significance of safeguarding the forest's delicate equilibrium. However, the Council's final test for Andy was to demonstrate his commitment to this balance. They explained that the forest was facing a grave threat. A disturbance from a neighboring realm had disrupted the harmony of the mushroom world. To restore balance, Andy would need to journey to the neighboring realm and negotiate with the inhabitants to cease their actions. Lumi, the sprite, stepped forward and offered to guide Andy to the realm beyond the mushroom world. But beware, Lumi warned, crossing into this realm requires traversing the Bridge of Luminance, a passage of light and shadow that connects our worlds. 
It is a journey fraught with challenges and unknown dangers. Andy accepted the council's task with unwavering determination. He knew that this was his chance to make a difference, not only for his colony, but for the entire enchanted mushroom world. With the council's blessing, Lumi, Silva, and the Great Mushroom Council itself, Andy prepared to embark on the perilous journey across the Bridge of Luminance, ready to face whatever challenges lay ahead and restore the balance of the forest. With the wisdom of the Great Mushroom Council as his guide, Andy, accompanied by Lumi and Silva, embarked on the perilous journey to the neighboring realm across the Bridge of Luminance. The bridge was a shimmering passage that connected the enchanted mushroom world to an unknown land beyond. As they stepped onto the bridge, its surface felt like a path of dreams beneath their feet. The realm they entered was unlike anything Andy had ever seen. The sky above was a palette of swirling colors and the ground below was adorned with flora that seemed to dance to an unheard melody. Finally, they arrived at the Crystal Grove, a place of breathtaking beauty. Giant crystals of every hue sprouted from the ground, their radiant glow casting a mesmerizing play of colors. At the heart of the grove, stood the source of the disturbance, a rift between realms that pulsed with chaotic energy. Before Andy could approach, a figure emerged from the rift, a creature made of light and shadow. It was the guardian of this realm, Lumina, who had the power to bridge the two worlds. Lumina regarded Andy with a mixture of curiosity and wariness. Why have you come to our realm, little ant? With a heart full of determination and the wisdom of the Great Mushroom Council in his mind, Andy shared his mission to restore balance and harmony to both realms. He spoke of the interconnectedness of their worlds and the importance of working together. Lumina, after listening to Andy's heartfelt plea, extended a luminous hand and said, If you are willing to negotiate for the greater good and seek a peaceful solution, then I shall guide you through the rift and help you communicate with those who have caused the disturbance. Andy, Lumi, and Silva exchanged glances, knowing that their journey had only just begun. As they stepped through the rift, they were filled with hope that their efforts would bring about a resolution that would benefit both the enchanted mushroom world and the realm of light and shadow.